Allen. We'll get vision on the enemy Raptors. That Rift Rivals now seeing effort jump onto it as well. Chasing Tom. onto lava. Yeah, gonna get locked down here. They're all gonna go low, flash away from Dalkey. Nice little pathing here from the Zac from yep. behind. Coming from behind, flash away immediately from Key. The grab not gonna connect. And Song Yun able to jump away with the arcane shift. Effort just gonna be blocking here with the unbreakable. Towards the top side. Ward in the river this time for Tall. So Will spots on one coming in. Gets slowed up. Go ahead, pop the ultimate. And now it's gonna be Blank joining in the fray with the TP coming in from the bot side. Bang looking to arrive. It's level six, has that chain of corruption, and Baker rotates first. Linderong trying to charge down the river, and you can see Lava's not even coming over to help him. Kind of just acknowledge that the Mundo is going to be dead. That's first blood. Back by the kid, Blank coming nearby. He's going to jump in there, but too late. Have to hop out. Now maybe going in. We'll go ahead and try to turn this one around. Misses the hit in on the Song Wan, which means that Baker's not going to have a last breath set up for him. And try again. No Yasuo nearby this time. That's going to be the flash forward. Looking for the kidnap. Does not have it. Forces the flash. Lava now up top, jumping over the wall, gonna be looking for Tall. He flashes away, the rate comes down, as does the Shadow Assault. Like you said, there's no stopwatch, which means that he will not be towards the bottom. There's out the ward, now jumping in. Blank gonna be looking for Song Yoon. It's the grab, but now they have to retreat. Four members of Hanwha Life collapsing in. Blank tries to jump away with the kidnap. He's gonna get locked down. We'll have that pass that popped, and SKT just have to watch him die. Baker banded it very early. You still them getting ready to go in for the steal. Launches himself in, goes a bit deep, locked up with the Glacial Prison. The spike comes down, and Song Wan finds the mountain over from the side of Hanwha Life. That's going to be the second one for them. SKT now trying to find a pick. Linderong pops the ultimate. Talon going in deep, looking for effort. Can't pop him as Blank re-engages, but he doesn't have the passive, and he is just going to get lit up immediately. Now Tall way too far forward. True Shot Barrage comes in. That's a double kill over to Song Yoon. Hanwha Life just keep pushing forward. There's nothing the bank can do. The flash has already been burned. That's a triple kill now for the Ezreal. Baker and Effort. The only ones to make it out with their lives. Played a BF sword on top of the Tiamat and the pickaxe. Yeah, he is looking quite good. And Tull, well, he's looking to be in bad shape because here comes Lava. Linderong's on top. We'll go ahead and take away the kill. Does get the Infernal, but now Blank. Oh, boy, he's going to get locked up, and he's going to have to say goodbye. It's popped immediately, and I don't think SKT, yeah, no. Not going to be willing to commit a teleport to try to keep him Looks like SKT might have to try to. No, never mind. It's double spot. They, they can bait out the Unbreakable and the Wind Wall. They'll have a lot of options. It's a nice interrupt. Then, yeah, it's going to be the interrupt there. Archie Assault coming through. Faker playing forward, finding connecting in on the effort. Faker just keeps rotating back and forth, top to mid, trying to help keep these towers alive. Now he's going to help Cal as he goes low. Never move connects on the Linderong, but he's still a Mundo. Blank jumps on the lava, but not going to be able to get a kill. Now effort going forward. Q on to Song Yoon. He's got the arcane ship. Keeps himself nice and alive. Uh oh. Last breath does connect. They're looking for the Ezreal. Tag back on the Faker. Takes him down to half HP. He pushes forward. Looking for the kill here. On a Song Wan. Manages to find it. As Bang gets that final blow, but flash over the wall for Glendoron. <laughs> Paul flashes back out. All right, Blank. He's in vision again. Yep. Jumping in. Not going to get pooped this time, but instead, she's going to get mopped. Passive already going to get rocked now. Everyone piling in. Last breath on to the Mundo. Baker will be able to get the kill. No half HP. It's all looking for a never, ne uh, never move, but cannot have the connection there. Blank comes back in. Locked up immediately by the Glacial Prison. Windwall going to be blocking that binding. Gets the kidnap off, but Song Wan goes gold, and Linderong is just wreaking havoc in the back, back line. Finds a double kill. Baker goes forward, manages to take care of one, but he's just got no HP remaining, and he is just... Uh, in such a rough spot. Guardian Angel gonna get popped third and final inhibitor gonna be going down. Baker tries to stay alive, tries to get a kill on the Song Yun, but he just can't manage it. 11 for Hamal Life to close this one out. 424. Blank goes back in. Has to pop the stopwatch, but it's gonna be delaying the inevitable. Hanwha Life will be taking us to a third and final game, the sixth game night. Welcome back to me. who couldn't just rotate around the map, was stuck in this extended 2v2. A lot of the action happened around the power of the Varus pick in lane. They downplayed that, they played up their own strengths, and by the end, it was looking a bit desperate from the side of SKT as the Zac initiations were honestly a little bit sad towards the end. Yeah, I mean, the Sejuani just consistently blocking those elastic swing shots from coming in.